Good morning, we are back with another vlog. It is 8.50 in the morning, so I look a little tired. And yeah, I just woke up like 10 minutes ago. But today, look what I'm dressed for. I hope I'm in the right attire. So today I'm going to hot yoga for the first time. I'm going with a friend I met recently by where I live. So we both have never done it. So hopefully it goes good. We're doing like a moderate class, so it's not like super, super hard, I hope. Um, the class is only like 80 degrees compared to some that are like 100. So I'm just gonna wear leggings. Um, I need to get shoes and socks still. And then I'm gonna wear just this like loose top. And then if I do wanna wear just a sports bra, I will wear a sports bra. I did yoga classes when I was like in fifth grade. And I think I kind of liked it, but we kind of made it like as a joke, like me and my friends that we were in it. I mean, we were in fifth grade, so like we wouldn't take everything seriously. And we'd kind of just like, you know, stand in the tree position. <laughs> but I guess I'm gonna head there soon so I can get there maybe a little bit early. Well, I am home from yoga. I got home actually a few hours ago. It wasn't even that hot in there. I feel like it was maybe normal temperature, but maybe a little bit warmer. I don't know, but it was fun. We were in the dark, and it was 65 minutes, so I liked it. And I'm out of breath and sweaty because I just got done with my one workout. I know I get so many questions on how I work out, what I do, and all that. Um, I usually don't. I would just, like, maybe walk around the block or something, but um, I wanted to do this two week. Well, it's three weeks, but I'm going to try and fit it in in two weeks. It's this get flat belly in three weeks at home and there's just like five different things to do and then you just do a bunch of reps of them and then each day is like a new one. So I'm on day four right now and I'm really proud of myself for sticking to it. Um, it gets you so sweaty and like out of breath like you kind of have to take breaks in the middle. And then this is, so I do this video every day, well day four, and then this is the other one that I do. I follow this girl. This is a really good one too. It's 10 minutes long and it's just like butt, thighs, and flat stomach. So then I follow this video too. I've been doing this one in the past. This will be my third day. So I will show you guys just a few of the steps. So first, she does these narrow squats with your legs together. And I know I don't do everything perfect, but hey, it's better than nothing. So these narrow squats, I can really feel the burn like right here. But this video plays music on it too, like it's like a bunch of remixes, so I really like listening to it, but for YouTube, I can't do that. So next are these like fire hydrant kicks, and then you go like up, so you just switch off. Fire hydrants to kickbacks. And then you switch legs, so we'll start right when she starts. And I love this video. So yeah, there's like 10 or 15 different workouts in this video. <sighs> See how hot it's getting me? Like, wow. Okay, this next one. It's like you go out, tuck in, out, in. Out, tuck in, out. See, like, honestly, you don't even need the machines. If anything, if you got weights and did some of this stuff with weights, but you don't even need that. These ones I like. Wide legs and, like, push your hips forward. Woo-wee. Okay, I am so sweaty. I need to go jump in the shower right now. Um, if you guys would like me to like kind of vlog this two week or however long I do it ab thing and also like my diet I mean obviously I'm still gonna eat like how I normally do but keep in the balance maybe eating healthier more of the week but yeah let me know if you guys would like to see that I'm going in the shower I'm about to eat a snack and I bought these like a week ago and there was mold on one of them so I'm like okay I need to eat the rest of these up 
So I just cut up three. Honestly, I might cut up one more because you don't get much kiwi from one kiwi once you take the skin off, which I saw a TikTok and someone said to eat the skin because you're supposed to, but I don't know about that. But also I just opened my new dust buster. My boyfriend got me and him a dust buster because we both needed one, so I'm so excited. <laughs> what really needs cleaned out though is my car. This is where all the mukbangs happen and I always get so many crumbs in here, but I try and vacuum it out often so I can keep it clean. It is dinner time, so I'm going to use some leftover taco meat and make a taco salad. So I have my lettuce and then now I'm going to warm up the rest of this meat with some cheese on top of it in the microwave so the cheese gets all melty as well. Check out my beautiful flowers, I'm obsessed. Okay, so next I'm going to take some spicy Doritos because I only have the spicy ones and crush them up in a bag. And then this is all warm and melty and then I also have the crushed Doritos. I'm going to put the meat on top with the cheese. And then next goes on the crushed Doritos. And then I use the spicy ranch. The sauce is so good. And voila, delicious. Okay, so I got an Amazon package. Let's open it up. I'm pretty sure this is for my eyelashes, which I'm so excited for this because when you open up some fake eyelashes, you wear them one time and then after that you like stick them somewhere and like half the time you either lose them or lose one of them. So I got this thing. Oh, I'm excited. So I was like looking on Amazon if they had like an eyelash organizer so I could put it in one of my drawers and keep them all separated because right now, look I just have eyelashes like sitting everywhere. Oh my gosh, there's literally a pair right there too. Just sticking on the wall. So I got this rose gold organizer. It looks like a book. So then I can put all my eyelashes in here, shut it, and just keep it in one of my drawers. I like it. Look how cool this is. So now I can like see them and everything. And I'll put this clear thing back over it and just shut it and put it in one of my drawers. Today I'm spending the day with my mom. She came down to hang out and go shopping with me. And we just got done sealing all my counters. So like nothing is on the counters right now because I kept getting stains in the marble. It was really making me sad. There's just little yellow spots and some spots. Part of that is part of the stone though. She thinks it's just the stone, some but. Parts are. This, this maybe isn't. That's a stain and then also there's like a yellow one right here. I mean, it mat it blends in with the marble, but I had a stain on the counter, and as soon as I wiped it, it left a mark. So I was like, ugh. We're about to go get some food and go to like Ikea. But first, let's give you guys a fit check. So, top, Joa Brown. Jeans, Abercrombie, my favorite jeans, the most comfy. Shoes, Target, and I can finally wear these shoes because after I got my foot surgery a long, long time ago, I couldn't wear any shoes for like two years. That hit the top of my foot. And then next, the same pair. <laughs> yeah, we have matching. And then necklace, my nails are so bad. Necklace is Target. All right, let's see yours. All right, my shirt's from Kohl's. My necklace is from Papa Pappas. Um, I have, uh, my jeans are Old Navy. My shoes are Kohl's. And my bracelets are Alex and Annie. There's a lemon. Did I get you any of them? Um, I have a sand dollar and the seashell, thinking beach. I would always get you those for holidays. Are yeah. any of those from me? I don't know if those are any. Maybe the lemon did you get me? For your birthday, maybe. Yeah. So. Well, that's it. That is our outfit of the day. You guys never see my mom, but look, she's getting comfortable on camera. I found the shirt that's been missing since move-in day. Yeah, I just got this shirt the same day as moving day, and then as soon as I unboxed it, it went missing, and I was going crazy. I'm like, it's got to be in the house. I was, I was going crazy, because <laughs> I was like, I never even got to wear it, and yeah, it's, it's cute. cute. So, let's go get some food. All right, let's go. <laughs> I just realized my foundation 
is like five shades darker than my skin. I just got this foundation, and now that I'm in like the sunlight, can oh, you not guys sunlight. see it? It's not sunny. I mean, on camera it looks good, which is weird. Like it matches my arm, if you look at it that way, but my neck is so pale. We are back. I forgot to vlog. We went to Home Goods and Ikea, and I got some lamps, yay! And also I'm drinking coffee from Panera. It's actually really good, and it's eight o'clock right now, so it's not a good idea for me to be drinking this, but it was raining all day, if you can't tell by my hair. It's a frizzy mess. I need to get a haircut tomorrow and get all these dead pieces cut off, but I got a vanilla latte because they're out of caramel. I wanted the caramel one, but this one's really good. But let me give you guys a little haul. Ignore all the stuff on my oven. I was sealing the marble, um, but it should be sealed now so I can put everything back. So first I got this trash can that says Toss um, by Ray Dunn at Home Goods for one of the bathrooms upstairs. I really like it, it's like a matte black. So cute. And then next, me and my mom both got this. Look how cute this is. Another Ray Dunn thing. It says fruit. And you can like make a fruit bowl in here and just keep it in your fridge. If you guys can't tell, I love all the things with like the words on it. And then next, I got this big, long plant. Love the fake plants. Like, these are perfect for like big spaces. Like even right there looks cute. Look at this. I was thinking like on a bookshelf or some type of like table along the wall just to fill up some space. Um, but yeah, it's so cute and I love the color of it. It's like the dark green. Also happy pride month. I got my rainbow straw. And then I got this to hang up somewhere. It says be the reason someone smiles today. I just love the font kind of like a rose gold color and then the frame is white. So I'm not sure where I'm gonna hang this yet, but really like that. And the last thing from Home Goods, I got another plant. They have new cute plants every single time I go there. This one just has like the white flowers on it, so it's a little different than all the other ones I have. So that's really cute. And then from Ikea, I got some more chip clips. I gotta keep those chips fresh, they get still so quick. And I got this cute black watering can with a gold handle. Love it. I'm becoming a plant lady, even though half my plants are fake. And then I got this succulent. I love it. I also got this cute little yellow flower. So those are both real. And then I got this big one from Ikea that I'm gonna put like in the corner or something for some height. Big ball. So here's one of the lamps I got. This one's gold. It looks like this. I think I'm gonna put in the family room. Also, update on the ceiling. All the plumbing is fixed and now layers of drywall have been placed on. And then it just needs sanded and painted. But yeah, this room is pretty dark. I have my umbrella light on. So I got a lamp for in here and then also a lamp for the office. And here's my new lamp. The gold matches really well with this gold table. And then also there's like gold on the side of the coffee table. So I think it's like a good accent color. And then when it's lit up, it looks like this. And you can move this one around. And if you wanna just turn that one off, you can. So that brings a lot of light into the room. Next is this one. It kinda reminds me of like the Pixar lamp, like a studio lamp that has three lights. All right, so it is the next day. I was saying bye to my mom and it was just late. And I also have the biggest pimple on my chin ever. <laughs> it hurts really bad. But I got my lamp set up, so take a look. It's so cute. I really like it. Let me step back a little bit so you could see it more. This lamp is not gonna stay there. It doesn't match at all, but this like color of the desk, oh, all these cords makes me wanna vomit. I don't know what to do with them. I hate it, it's so messy. <laughs> I think maybe my desk needs to go against the wall, which sadly I liked it in the middle, but there's the lamp. The color matches really well. And then also I put my big tree right here. I'm obsessed, it's so cute. As I get more furniture and stuff, I will of course show all of that. Um, but the house is still pretty empty right now. Um, I don't even have a 
like a new bed yet. I still have my old bed and it's pretty empty still. I don't even have a kitchen table or bar stools <laughs> technically. So until I get it like more furnished, you guys will see more of the place. But I hope you enjoyed this vlog. If you enjoyed it and want more, please click the thumbs up and subscribe. Also click my notification bell and I will see you all next time. Bye guys.